Really good energy. Anybody work in um, food service or any occupation, or have you ever worked in an occupation where that involves tips? Yeah. So you know what that ego feeling is like when you get stiffed. Oh yeah. I mean, maybe it's never happened to anybody here. Yeah. But I'm going to explore that a little bit through the prism of uh, our host and uh, Kyle and uh, I mean, Kyle's our bartender, uh, Casey, our host, and um, just going to uh, do something I haven't done before. So we'll see. We'll see how this goes. We'll just have fun with it. Yeah. We'll just roll with it. That's how we roll here. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's do this. A uh, little more setup. Uh, there's the scenario is it's been several weeks and these guys have been stiffed by folks coming through the good foot. They're really pissed off. So what we're kind of getting here is a depiction of what it could be like if that were to happen. Very upset folks. The evil good foot open mic. Okay? <laughs> I'm Kyle, your host. Good for an open mic. However, there's a problem here. Several consecutive weeks, hey lady, several consecutive weeks, there's been no chip in my jar. How am I supposed to pay rent? You know, I live here sometimes just because I can't afford what you all put here, which is Nada. <laughs> this is, uh, that's all here of the good foot here. I'm Casey, and no one, no one is graduating from the good foot open mic university until tuition is paid. Yeah. Ask for David Little. Now, David Little, you can try to come here and bring the funny, but that doesn't pay the bills. You need to bring some money. <laughs> bring some money. If not, we're going to start booing you like they do at the Apollo in New York. Try to perform there. See what happens. Just saying. <laughs> and some of you... I don't mean to call people out, especially those ones that talk all the time when I talk, which really pisses me off. Some of you need more time in the mirror rehearsing, singing to yourselves, or singing in the shower. But when you come here with no money, no money that doesn't pay my bills, Think of, think of your tip as good foot over my tuition. Yeah. Okay. Good. We got, we got some, we have some good students here that understand what it's like. There's a lot, some of you are really talented, but others, you consider the dollar that, that uh, you pay. I mean, we got to listen to your sorry asses. <laughs> So you consider that a pay, you know, a, a payment, you know, for it. So fill the jar, or I'll have to instruct Brian, better known as a wizard, to make all your recordings sound like Pee Wee Herman. You get home and you start playing, and you'll wonder what happened. Just saying. This is an open. This is an American Idol. Okay, when you don't pay your tuition here at Open Mic. You don't pass with a, with a, there we go, we had a good student here. Thank you, give him a little, show him a little love. This is an American Idol, so we don't just pass folks on, but you know, we have to understand what it is that some of us go through to do this for you. So, Kyle, you wanna let them know how you feel? Yeah, Kyle has something to say to you too. Kyle is your bartender. <laughs> he 
if I <laughs> if I don't eat, I get cranky. I can't eat air. It's not nutritious. So pay up, you cheap bitches. Pay up. I'm really angry here. I try to be mellow and okay, but sometimes people don't respect that. No. I'm really angry. No. I'm so angry, you know, I want to take my Italian and black penis and <laughs> bitch slap some of you back and forth. Back and forth. Yeah, part of my penis is black, so I can reach you from here. Like a lasso, you won't make it to the door. Capiche? Bada bing, bada boom. Some of you all, I gotta actually get hammered to listen to folks. Especially talk while I'm talking. Yeah, well, come over here, I'll serve you. You get a little Kool-Aid in your red wine. Um, and a little piss in your beer. This has to be full. For so I know you'll get the message. I could I could get drunk. I could get you drunk. Steal your instruments, take it to the pawn shop, the pawn shop, or pawn shop, whatever you got. <laughs> but we're better than that here at the Good Foot. So help me have a better attitude about having something to eat. Again, air is not nutritious. I don't want to be in a bad mood. I don't want you to wonder what you're consuming because you pissed me off. <laughs> yeah, I'm Kyle. Remember that. <laughs> People of the world, Portland, Oregon, my brothers and sisters tonight here at the Good Foot, yeah. this is our moment. This is our time. We have initiative now to help college tuition folks ease some of their loans and pressures. That will apply here to the good foot. We will ease the financial pressure, but I want to encourage all of you to tip something here in the box, in the, in, the, uh, in the tip jar for these good folks who work really hard. The wizard, Brian, your bartender, show him some love, Kyle, Casey, he's up here every week. No matter how bad you treat him and abuse him, sometimes you talk when he's talking. That's not right. <laughs> it takes the president to come here and point it out. Well, I'm going to do that. <laughs> so let's show some folks here some respect, the kind of respect you would like when you're on the stage performing. Because that's how we're going to learn to live together. We learn how to get along together and treat each other with respect. Yeah. yeah. Is that true? Okay. Thank you, good foot. Thank you for listening. Also, be sure to watch David Little Short Labs. I watch it. Michelle watches it. Bo watches it. Everybody watches it. Big David Little. YouTube.com backslash Big David Little. Watch it. We need to learn how to live together so we can learn how to laugh together, laugh together, live together. It all works the same. Thank you. God bless you. And God bless the United States of America. Here is a good foot. Thank you. I'm David Little.